Here they come, out of turn number four. Wave your hands, wave your hands, make some noise. What do you say? Attica Raceway Park. Tracks to the infield. We are ready to rock and roar. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, at Attica Raceway Park, it's time to get dirty for 30. Big wheel stands out of turn four. Byron Reed, Chris Andrews side by side out of turn two. Byron Reed with the advantage down the back stretch. Stands all over the one third mile clay oval of Attica Raceway Park. As Byron Reed's going to get a challenge now. Here comes Chris Andrews. DJ Foose runs third. Andrews up to the cushion in three and four. Byron Reed down around the tractor tires, side by side. They dustle off the high side of three and four, and he will stop, and that will bring out the caution flag with three laps in. Single file to the goodbye, the orange pylon, green out. Andrews again to the top shelf in one and two. Gets a big run out of turn two on Byron Reed. Reed likes those tractor tires down on the inside of three and four. Moving into the four spot, the 18 of Cole Macedo. Here comes Andrews again with a head of steam out of turn two. To the cushion in three and four, side by side with Byron Reed. And a Dussel doing donuts on the high side of turn two. He's still going. New for the lead, new leader, Chris Andrews. Chris Andrews to the cushion in three and four. Byron Reed to the outside. Here comes DJ Foose staying within stalking distance. Eight laps in this time by for Chris Andrews, Byron Reed, DJ Foose, Colt Macedo, Tyler Gunn, and Trey Jacobs. Traffic, gonna meet your leaders here in another couple of laps. 10 gets scored this time by. New leader, but a lead back to the front. No, Chris Andrews by a nose. Here they come, throw a doily on the top three down the back stretch. Chris Andrews goes down, chops off Reed's advance. Reed to the inside. And DJ Foose. Three-car battle as we race in the lap traffic. Here comes Trey Jacobs, the challenge for the four spot. Wow, right in front of your leader, Byron Reed to lead. Here comes DJ Foose. And the double zero of Tyler Street stops to the high side of turn number two. One upside down in turn four. Here we go, 12 laps in, 18 to go. Green back out. Andrews again to the top shelf in one and two. DJ Foose looks to split him and Reed down the back stretch. Three wide for the lead out of turn four, wow! Now DJ 
Foose to the point down the back stretch. Andrew's gonna put a flyer on him. They go side by side in three and four. DJ Foose, your new leader. Chris Andrews, big run out of turn two again. Cross flags go in the air, halfway home in this one. DJ Foose, your new leader over Chris Andrews. Byron Reed behind them, Trey Jacobs and Travis Philo. And here comes the 0-9 of Craig Mintz. DJ Foose pulling away a little bit now. Here comes Byron Reed racing to the inside of Chris Andrews for second. DJ Foose with about a 10 car length advantage down the back stretch. Byron Reed to the inside of Chris Andrews. 18 laps this time by. Travis Philo in the fifth spot. Trey Jacobs reeling in that battle for second as DJ Foose pulls away. Could be a good point night for Trey Jacobs, who came into the night just five points behind Colt Macedo for the point lead. Nine laps to go for DJ Foos. Fire Reed again races to the inside of Chris Andrews for that runner up spot. Lap traffic ahead with eight laps to go. DJ Foos gonna have to make some moves in lap traffic as Byron Reed takes the second spot. Byron Reed coming to life late in the race. Still racing for second, Chris Andrews regains the spot from Byron Reed. Here comes Trey Jacobs. We got a three car battle for the runner up spot with your leader right in front of them. Two lap cars separate your leader. Oh, Chris Andrews off the high side of one and two. Five laps to go for DJ Foose. Now Trey Jacobs into the second spot. Yellow comes out. DJ Foose looking for his fourth career 4-10 win at Attica Raceway Park. That team has been solid all year. He has three wins at Fremont Speedway as we go back to green. DJ Foose, Trey Jacobs with a good run off the bottom of turn two as they pull away from Byron Reed. Four laps to go and here comes Trey Jacobs. Trey Jacobs looking for his first ever win at Attica Raceway Park. Races to the inside of DJ Foose, side by side with three laps to go. Jacobs to the inside, DJ Foose goes down the block, the advance with two to go. Jacobs again with a monster run off the bottom of turn two as the white flag goes in the air for DJ Foose and Trey Jacob. Stretch one final time. Foose gonna go down the block in three and four. Checkered flag in the air for DJ Foose. <laughs> He's got the helmet off, the hat on. Make some noise for DJ Foose. You know, a couple weeks ago at Fremont, you said 
you were going to be happy with five or six wins this season. Well, you got five now. And boy, what a move down here to hold off Trey Jacobs. I think he kind of surprised you getting under you there at three and four, and you went down to block, and he couldn't get around you. You know, truthfully, I looked up at the board. I, I look at the board a lot. I seen we had 23 laps to go. I was like, okay, seven more, put seven good ones together, and then we got the yellow. I seen Trey was in second. I knew where he was going to be, so I kind of had to protect my line. I mean, I left him just enough room that he could still make the corner, but, you know, last week – I feel like I really missed out on one, and I wasn't going to let this happen to my guys again. Uh, we have a lot of momentum right now. Our car is really, really good. Uh, Mikey Summers, Doug Berryman, Rod and Raleigh, Burmeister, they all do such a great job on this car, Lee Summers. And, uh, man, I'm just so excited to be up here. I, I knew starting fourth, and then I finally got to the lead, and then a caution came out the one time. I was like, here we go again. <laughs> Last week all over again. But I blitzed it in there across one and got by both of them. I noticed Chris's tire was kind of going flat on that restart. So... I kind of thought maybe he'd be a sitting duck, and uh, I was able to take advantage of it. Uh, I'd rather just pulled away and won by a mile, but I was pretty uh, nervous there seeing Trey on the inside of me in three and four. I, I couldn't really get off a of turn two there at the end, but uh, good for them guys. But, I mean, I'm just so happy for this Burmeister Racing crew. Five wins in 2021, two of them here at Attica Raceway Park. Once again, make some noise for DJ Foose.